Next one is 2-3, Labyrinth Entrance. So he has found another of Gandalf's upgrades. This was unforeseen, though it should prove useful in the challenges to come. The lost city of Aghata looms before him. I wonder if you know what truly lies ahead for you, Gabriel, what God has in store for you. The land of the Lycans. This ruined city now belongs to their lord, and you can be sure he will not allow you to pass without forfeiture of your life. But in order to bring her back, you need to defeat him, my friend. You need to crush him into the dust, like the worm that he is. Worm? That's not a very nice thing to say about the Lord of the Lycans. Oh. Fun. More tutorial stuff. Yep, thank you. Can, can I leave the door now? Big guy hurts. Yeah, you don't want to kill the warhound. That's right, get in my way. Get in my way and you end up with a cog to the face. That sounded completely weird. This is probably one of my least favorite animals to ride around on. Went and killed him. We're actually coming up on the light gem that is hidden on this level. Sorry, it took me a while to remember what it was that we were coming up on. It's the third out of the th out of thirty. There's also an upgrade here. But the upgrade requires cyclone boots, so you can't get them just yet. It just yet. So the upgrade is literally just dead ahead. Head down these stairs here. Well, not the upgrade, the light gem. Sorry, light gem. And there it is. Head back up the stairs. Yeah, if I block off, then though I might end up crashing to my desktop. <laughs> Thank you, but I would rather not crash the game. I actually do block quite often, but it... yeah, never mind. I'm gonna stop talking about that, at least. Oh, 
Hmm, oh, this be fun. Another thing that takes a while to learn on the uh, desktop is how to do these. You just need to hit it as if you were playing a console game. You have to be quick here, otherwise they do regen and... Come on. No, wrong way. They might end up doing so because I got turned around. As you noticed there, I ended up stumbling because I wasn't paying attention, but basically you need to hit your uh, keys in order to run around in a circle as quickly as you possibly can. Health fountain over here, kind of hidden. Corpse over here. Doesn't drop anything but a scroll. Hmm. So, like how I was pointing out with the spiders, each creature has their own page that you get later on that says what they're weak against. Anyways, up through here is the upgrade. I'll show you the exact spot, however you need the cyclone boots and shadow magic to get through it. Right here, basically you would activate your shadow magic, pre press shift and hit a, a key and you would run through the wall. For this jump, get a running jump on it. Otherwise you end up falling into the abyss below. Or if you have the shoulders, you can just jump across. <laughs> Double tap it, you're, you're good. It's my lever! Give it back the lever! I want to move forward in the game. It's not that hard once you get used to the controls to gain focus. Apparently he's weak in staggers. Okay, here comes the fun camera thing that I hate. Yeah, the first time I played this game I ended up standing still for so long, well, running around that thing for so long trying to get the piece put into place that it wasn't even funny.
Seriously? We're, we're that little below to get the move? That, that's not cool. That's really not cool. Oh well.